Welcome to the Hookup Tackle Christmas Special. Let's go inside and see what kind of fun we can find. Merry Christmas Eve, everyone. Let's go. Welcome to the Hookup Tackle Christmas Special. Happy Sunday, my friends. Merry Christmas Eve. Jeff? Yes, sir. It's a wonderful Sunday morning. It is. It's good to see you. Cheers, my friend. Would you like a beer? Absolutely not. That's kind of my mm. Christmas wish, is just to hear you reject me oh, one more lovely? time this season. It's so Would, great. Are you sure you don't want a beer? Well, now that you mention that, yeah, no. Okay. Yeah, twice Definitely in, no. Twice in actually. one day. We are breaking away from the norm a little bit today because, look, it's Christmas Eve. I didn't want to put any of your lives in jeopardy by dropping any limited edition drops. I didn't want you to get in trouble with your family. I wanted you to spend time with your family, just like we are doing today. I also didn't want to get any terrible hate mail, much like the hate mail we got just the other week. And you know what? I would love to share that with you. So I brought my own family in, my youngest son, Carson. Carson, would you read this beautiful, touching Christmas hate mail? Rat ass cocksuckers, that's okay. We just ordered from Japan. Thank you very much, Carson. Thanks for dressing up for this Christmas episode. Ethan, thank you very much. So for all of you that do comment nicely, cheers to you. Uh, it is always heartfelt. I love reading the comments. We have an amazing community, minus a couple of oddballs, but you know what? They need celebrating too. So Merry Christmas, Rex, despite the wonderful email. So let's get started. Before we do, Jeff, I wanted to share a little Christmas story with you. Okay. Are you up for it? Yeah. Is it about beer? Carson, will you hold my beer? <laughs> Don't drink it. Okay? Don't be like your older brother. I didn't celebrate Christmas as a kid. Okay? It wasn't a holiday that my family celebrated. Our religion didn't have Christmas. So, I actually didn't celebrate my first Christmas until I was 18. Wow. And my high school girlfriend at the time invited me to spend Christmas with her and her mom. So that was my first Christmas. Wow. Now, she knew I was into fishing, so she went down to the local tackle store and solicited the help of, you know, the people in the shop and said, hey, I want to make this amazing gift for my boyfriend. Can you help me? And so my first Christmas gift was actually a tackle box full of all the dopest tackle that was in that shop, which is pretty awesome as a first gift, right? Now, why am I sharing this story? Well, Later in the day, she told me, hey, those guys seem pretty cool. Maybe you should go down to that tackle store and make some friends, right? So I did. So I went into that tackle store and I thanked them for taking good care of her and steering her in a good direction. And I became friends with those guys and I still talk to all those guys even today. I see a lot of them every week when they come into shop. Some of them I don't talk to that often, but when we do, we still have that kind of, you know, kindred spirit. We're all part of the same team, right? That also introduced me to my love of tackle stores. And I thought their job was so cool that I asked for a job. And the owner of the tackle store told me that I didn't know enough to work there, maybe, you know, later. So I spent the next year just super diving into like pro shop tackle, JDM tackle, learning as much as I could. And I applied for a job again when I knew they needed help. And I was told, no, you're just not the right person for a tackle store. And I remember walking out of there thinking, you know what, Jeff? Fuck that guy. I'm gonna open up my own tackle say. store someday. And <laughs> here I am, right? So the lesson of this is, is it is so important to be mindful of what you're giving, but a gift is a lot more than a gift. A gift can open up doors, it can open up your mind, and that's certainly what happened to me on my first Christmas. Now, it was also amazing the time I got to spend with my girlfriend and her mom and her family, and I was surrounded by this incredible community. And fast forward a couple years later, I married that girlfriend, and for the last 30 years, I've had some incredible Christmases. So. My wish for you guys is I hope you get an amazing tackle box full of JDM tackle. If you do, I hope it opens some incredible doors, some incredible experiences. If you're told no through any path, it is just a wall. Mm. The choice is yours. If you want to turn around and go back 
or if you want to break through it, climb over it, go around it. I hope you are brave enough to do that. And I really wish you guys an amazing time with family because that is what Christmas is all about. Hug those ones tight that you have around you and enjoy the rest of the year. Merry Christmas, everyone. Hello, the Hookup Taco community. I'm Hideki of Tech Tales. Thank you for all the support of uh, Tech Tales. Uh, I really love to see the post of the fish on my product on the social media. It's my phone. I wish everyone a Merry Christmas and uh, the new coming New Year will be a good fishing year for all of you. Bye. Griff, do you have any wishes for the Hookup Tackle community that you would like to wish for this Christmas season? I just want everybody to have a Merry Christmas, find peace, be good, thank you. What's up guys, just wanted to wish you all a Merry Christmas, hopefully you all get what you wanted, uh, and I think from everyone here at the Hookup Tackle, we all just want to say thank you. What's up guys, I uh, just wanted to wish you all a Merry Christmas as well, uh, thanks for the business, and uh, we appreciate you all very much. Hey guys, Nate Cummings from here at the Hookup Tackle, just want to wish you a Merry Christmas, and I hope you all catch some big fish. Yo, what's going on guys? Uh, thank you so much for another amazing year here at the Hookup Tackle. I really appreciate it as much as everybody else here does. And it's been another fantastic year. Hopefully you guys have a very Merry Christmas. Hey, what's up guys? It's Hippie with the Hookup Tackle. And I just want to jump on here and thank you guys, every single one of you, for all the support and the business this year. It's been a phenomenal year. We can't thank you guys enough. Sorry I sucked on uh, the tournament scene, but thank you guys yeah, for, you for all the you know comments and, and motivation. It, it really is something special, and thank you guys. Merry Christmas from the Hookup Tackle. Hey, peace out. How many is five? Hello, Hookup Tackle community. Thank you so much for your love of JDM Tackle and support for Lucky Craft. Lucky Craft would like to wish your family a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Arigato gozaimasu. Griff, when you think back on the year, what was the funniest moment of 2023 for you? It's got to be the email. <laughs> the email. Ethan, funniest moment of 2023? Definitely going to be the Rex email. That was uh, that was that was pretty good. Definitely the Rex email. So, other than your tournament finishes, yeah, what's the funniest? <laughs> thing that you can think of this year. Do you like women? Well, Jeff, apparently hate mail was the funniest moment of 2023, so let's start a new segment. Our favorite hate mail. There's That was signed for a graphic. Got it, got it, got it. All right. To share, I mean, this is the holiday season we mm -hmm. need to share. Welcome back, my youngest son, Carson. Carson, would you be so kind to read said email from our wonderful friend, Rex? Take it away. I usually do buy from Japan or just borrow from, wait, do they know how to spell? They, they don't, it's, it's okay, these are boogans. Okay, Tommy Biffle, Jason Christie, even Evers or other Oklahoma pros. Sometimes my nephew, I'm going to Japan in December, I'll be fine. At least a bunch of you Facebook fags hadn't bought them all so you could rub on them and trade. Interesting tackle. But no T1 Japanese pussy wins. What matters? LF, MLF Bass Pro Tour. Keep fucking people. The West Coast D bags have just T about destroyed their tournaments with their liberal vo voting. Notice how no one votes to go to blue cap states with liberal policies. Fishermen hate West Coast. Don't worry, your business will dive with a leftist economy. I'll order with a group of pros. The only reason those baits sell, the people that use them. Quit fucking people, price gouging. Do you like women? Laughing emoji. Yeah. Boom. Nailed it. Beautiful. Love you, buddy. Love Wasn't you. that touching? Yeah. Thank you so much, Rex. <laughs> Hello, the hookup tackle community. I am OSP Lake Bear Base now. Uh, thank you for all support for OSP. Wish everyone a Merry Christmas. Arigati! Pedestal right there? 
I can get a stool for you if that would make you feel better. Why didn't you wear shoes today? No, you did. I don't even know what we're talking about. I don't either. Yeah, I just know that I'm taller than you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Every year, we love to give back when we can to our community. And one of the amazing things about this shop is, you know, at the end of every episode, I love to thank you guys for the support and the business, but really, this has become much more of a community uh, for me and for everybody that works here uh, and hopefully for you guys as well. So Griff, myself and Jeff went out the other day and wanted to just give back to our local pond fishing community uh, and just try to make some people's Christmases and kind of pimp our local pond. So uh, take a look at this. I hope you guys enjoy uh, going on this adventure with us. All right, if you guys follow me on Instagram at all, you see me post three or four days a week that I fish urban ponds here in Phoenix. And I, I don't do that because they're great fishing. I do that because uh, my youngest son has class down the road in one of the most ghetto urban ponds that we have, and I'm just nervous that I'm not around him. Uh, but it's a way of fishing that I grew up doing, Jeff grew up doing, you grew up doing, and it's so hard. It literally took me two years to catch my first bass out of the pond that I fish three days a week. So today we thought, you know, if it's a struggle for us and we have access to the greatest tackle in the world, how does a normal dude or kid or family come to these places and catch fish? So today we're just going back into the community and we're gonna just try to pimp out some of these ponds around us, expose some of these uh, anglers that may not usually get to see good rods, good reels, JDM tackle. Uh, we're kind of in the middle of trout stocking, so we've got some cool JDM trout bags, we've got bag full of reels, we've got a bunch of rods. Uh, we're just gonna go give some stuff away and be Santa for the day. Are you ready? Let's go, let's do let's it. Let's go, let's have some fun. Hey, how's it going? I wanna get you a rod for Christmas. Yeah, new rod for you, it's a Major Craft Nano Ace rod. Uh, I'm gonna give you a reel, too. So I'm gonna give you, let's give him a Daiwa Fuego. How about a new Fuego? I already put line on it for you and everything, so you can use it today if you want. And just wanna wish you Merry Christmas, dude. All right, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, dude. First time fishing? First time ever. Are you having fun? Any luck yet? Had a nibble. Had a nibble, okay. So he's using your rod. He's using my rod. Okay, well. Let's change that. Can I give you a Christmas present? All right, I'm gonna give you, let's give them something that'll work. How about a G. Loomis trout rod? Wow. So here's a G. Loomis trout rod. You're gonna need a reel for that thing too. So here's a Daiwa Kage 1000. I spent all night last night putting line on it. So you've got line as well. Let's get you some lures too. What are you using right now, you using bait? All right, let's change that. Here's a box of tackle. There's some really cool, very expensive, fun lures in there, okay? Thank so play with them much. and see what, see what happens. Thank you so much. All right, Merry Thank Christmas you to you guys. You. you got it. Merry Christmas, guys. I brought some tackle for you. Oh, you. So you're welcome. Cool. Here you go, yeah, you got it. Thank you. I like, how did she get the bait caster and you got the spinning? I gave her the brand new one. You, well, hey, you need a brand new one too. So, here you go. Sure, boss. Merry Christmas. Got a brand new Major Craft rod for you. I got a reel for you too, so hang tight. Yeah, that one's perfect. It's a righty, I know that one's a lefty. Yeah, so you'll have, right. to, you'll have to suffer. Oh, you're righty, good. Yes. So there you go, it's a new seven bait casting reel. Nice. So now you can both fish the bait caster. Deal? I got a question for you. Hit me. I got a kid that comes. His mom always leaves him with me. He's about, what time do you think he'll be here? He gets out of church at noon. Okay. You guys won't be here, huh? Probably not, uh, but let's leave him some stuff That's and you can I give ask. him a, a good Christmas That's gift. Deal? Saying, let's do it. Him, let's leave, let's leave a rod, bro. I appreciate you. Okay. Is that Here's a rod. Room? What's that? I thought that was a fly room. No, I'm not going to go down fly. that path. Let's I'm keep him in the good fly. fishing, man. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's I'm get him. Let's get him a reel, too. So here you go. There's already line on it. Nice. Okay. Oh, you know what? You're going to need line for that reel. Let's give him a spool of line. Yep, perfect. Here's a spool of sun line, too. What made you guys do this? Uh, we have a tackle store. It's a small little family tackle store around the corner. So we're just 
going around making sure. I know how hard fishing is out here, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's next to impossible. Do you guys do so, flies? No, I do good fishing. Good. Calm down with that fly fishing <laughs> stuff, man. Yeah. Catfishing. Catfishing. Do you ever mess with the trout? No. No? Never tried it. You want to try it? What kind of poles is them? It looks like you need two piece rods. Yeah. Here. Here's a brand new St. Croix trout rod for Christmas. Thank you. You're welcome. I got a reel for you too. Let's do a 2,000. Oh, let's do that 1,000. Give me that kage. Let me ask, is that open face? Is that it is a spinning reel. Okay. It's spinning reel. So it's a kage 1,000, super nice reel. I already put line on it for you. Thank so you. literally go do what you got to do. Come back and try trout. Okay, Merry Christmas to you. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome, man. Merry Christmas, dude. All right, thank you, bro. Well, I can't help you make the fishing much easier, but I can help you and give you some new gear for Christmas. How about that? You want some new gear? Yeah. Oh, thanks, buddy. So, hey, you don't even know what I gave you yet. It might not be great, but it is great. Here, how about a new rod? How about a new rod? You're welcome. I thought you guys just had one. I saw you from across the way, but here's another one too, just in case, okay? Oh God, hey, you're gonna, you. you're gonna need reels too, okay? So I got new reels for you too. So these are Dio Fuegos, okay? These are super fancy, so be nice to them, okay? I put line on these. So all you need to do is just put the reel on the rod do, mommy will do it for you. and you're good to go, okay? Thank you! You're welcome, Thank you. you're welcome, dude. Is this for me? Yeah. Are we trading? Is this for me for Christmas? Yeah. So what is it, is there a name? Puffy. Puffy for me? Hey. Christmas. Bro. Thank you. Uh -oh. Merry Christmas. This guy's so nice. Well, thank you, so thank you for much. bringing him out. This is the best thank activity in the world. Thank you so much. Hey, and thank you for my gifts. <laughs> all right, so check it. So this box can hold all your lures, okay? Hey. Yeah. This is my favorite one is Damien. That's your favorite? Why is yeah. that your favorite? So we can see do it. Oh, you like the clear ones? My Heck yeah. Are these. Yeah, he's already figuring out that high pressured color system. I like these. You like this one. You like the swim baits. You gave me a swim bait and I'm giving you one back. So that's a mega bass swim bait. The hook's in there. Okay, I know it's hard to see, but the hook is underneath this little. I'm so happy right now. I love Good. fishing. And yeah. We when I grew up, up, my whole career about the fishing. I like Hell yeah. I like fishing. Like yeah. yeah. Really? You love fishing that much? Yeah, I want to. I want to be a YouTuber of fishing tournaments. I want to be a YouTuber and fish. Okay, so you know <laughs> that that dude right there, he's a famous YouTuber. That guy. So you should go give him knuckles. That's Jeffrey the King. Have you ever heard of Jeffrey? Thank you. So give me, give me a minute. I'm going to come back. Okay? So here, work on setting, try to put that reel on that rod, and then when I come I back, I'll okay. show you guys how to cast it, okay? <laughs> She's like, I watched this. Okay, I'll be back. Give me five minutes. So I wasn't planning on meeting a future tournament angler, but just in case it happened, I put a couple of casting rods in there. We're going to just go hook these kids up. They seem super passionate about it, uh, and they've got a good support behind them. So let's go, let's go hook them up with some tournament gear. We got some line, we got some reels, we got some P5s, we got some sacred. I mean, we got everything. So let's go make their Christmas. Let's do it. My um, shadow box is in here. Okay. You got Did you load it up with all your lures? Yeah. Okay. So check it out. I wasn't expecting to meet a future tournament bass fisherman today. Okay. But if you're going to be serious, I'm sure you look at tournament bass fishermen, they have like 900 rods, right? So you have to get a really good bait casting rod to be able to do this. Okay. And I know you want to be a YouTuber like Jeff over there. So you each need a bait casting rod, okay? So you're gonna get a Mega Bass Destroyer P5, okay? And you're gonna get a St. Croix Mojo, okay? Now, you need reels. You're gonna get a Daiwa Zillion to go with that. You're gonna get a St. Croix 7 to go with that, okay? You each need line. I wish I had them spooled up. I just happen to have them in my truck. So you each need this, okay? You're gonna need lures. Okay, so I'm gonna start you. Okay, so you get, actually, let's do this. Well, here, you guys can fight over them. Trade up, that one will be better for that rod and that one will be better for that rod. Okay, so you got a Mega Bass Sewage, a Mega Bass Eyelad, and these are gonna float. So you don't have to worry about them diving too deep. Okay, so check it. So good quality gear isn't always about money. 
Is it white? But sometimes it is, right? So I want you guys to have a great Christmas. So just so you know, I just want you to take good care of this. This is a $500 rod, okay? So you need to be careful. And that reel in there is almost 400, okay? So I'm, I'm basically giving you about a thousand bucks. So I need you to take good care of it, do you understand? Okay, go grab that reel. You had the white box one that says zillion on it. And I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you how to do this, okay? And if you decide you wanna quit fishing and take up bowling, then you can sell this for a good bowling ball. But that's not gonna happen, that's right? That's the one I've been wanting for years. This one? Years. This exact one? Yes. Heck yeah, man. I didn't ask you, are you righty or lefty? Are you right-handed? A perfect. All right, here, take that box. You can put it wherever. Okay, so check it, dude. Let me show you this. So this, this is how this is gonna set. So you're gonna twist this up and down, right? This is gonna slide on like this. And then this is just gonna lock it back down. That makes sense? So really easy. And this is how you're gonna hold this. You're gonna hold it like this and you're gonna wind it like this. Okay? Yes. Now, use YouTube to maybe try it. It's these are very very hard to learn how to cast. So I'm going to make you another offer if you want to take me up on it. My store is literally one mile down the road. If you want me to teach you how to use this, message the store. You can send me an email. You can call and you can just say, "Hey, I met Ben at the lake. He gave me a rod. He wants to teach me how to cast." Okay, and then we'll find a time that you can come down to the shop and I'll teach you how to throw it in my parking lot so that you can come back out here and practice. Does that sound good? Because you're gonna need help. It's really, really hard. And I don't want you to get frustrated. Deal? You can watch YouTube, you can learn how to spool it up, you can learn all the settings. I'm gonna let you explore, okay? Just like that, yeah. But there's some things you gotta learn and I don't want you to get too frustrated, okay? You're probably gonna have to help them. Okay, so and then if you just can't figure it out, you go. So my store is called the Hookup Tackle. Okay, I know you're a YouTuber, yeah. right? I know you guys watch YouTube. You can find I us on YouTube. My own YouTube videos already. It's called, what's it called? The Hookup Tackle. Do you want me to show you how to cast through those first rods I gave you? Yeah. yeah. Okay. But We're just gonna come yeah, like up like this through all this these. Way, you yeah. just gotta learn just the different knots. Dude. Dude. Okay, so. so if you tighten it's, this right here, there's eight okay, million you twist it, fishing. This, so you see how the line is right here? I'm gonna hold the line, I'm gonna open the bale, and then if I let go of the line, the lure just falls, right? So then I have to close the bale back and wind it up, right? Oh, look at that, I already snagged something. That's what I do here. It's a lot. Okay, so when you go to cast it, you do this. You hold the line, you open the bale. Okay, I'm just gonna watch out for this tree. And then you're just gonna kind of cast it. And then you let go when you're ready to throw it. Oh. And then it's out there. And then all you gotta do with this is just kind of wind it in. And maybe every once in a while, I'll just give it a little, hold it right there, yep. And then go back behind you. And then when you're ready to throw, just throw it and let go of the line with your finger. Perfect, look at that. Good job, dude. Give me knuckles, that was your first cast. Hey, give me five. Good job, Abel. Here, hold it like this. Hold it on that side of your body. There you go. Hold it right here with your hand, with this hand. Yep, and then wind it with that hand. Perfect, perfect. So then just with this finger, yep, and then open that bale. Yep, and then go back behind you. You're, you're good. And then when you're ready, just go forward and just let go of that line. Perfect, okay? So if you go too far this way or too high, then you let go just a little too soon. Uh-uh, uh-uh, we're gonna, oh, yeah. you're gonna be a professional tournament bass fisherman. Okay, hold on. Okay, now wind in. Okay, so yeah, you hold it there. This rod tip can go like here. That's the right way to wind this, okay? So no matter what, if you see somebody doing it upside down, we can make fun of them now because now you know better, right? This is the right way to do it. Hey. You practice, okay? I want to see you on the tournament circuit. I will. Okay? What was what was your name? Brayden. I'm Ben. Merry Christmas, Braden. Have fun, okay? Hey, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Yeah, thanks for bringing these kids. Thank you Merry so Christmas. Much. Take care. Hey, dude, what was your name? Abel. I'm Ben. Thank you. Yeah, Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. Take Merry care. Christmas. Thank you for my gift. Have fun fishing, okay? You're doing good, dude. Have a good day, guys. Merry Christmas. I got something for you. 
啊，对。You're good, dude. Hey, you want a present? Huh? Felice Navidad. For you. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Well here, you wind you wind that in first and I'll give I'll give this to you. Thank you. Hold on, you need a reel. So that's a new bait sandy rod. That's a zillion HD. Okay, it's big. Okay, but you're throwing big, big things, so I think you'll be okay. Mm -hmm. Okay? And then I've got some baits for you, too. I'm gonna go give them down. Is that your dad down there? Huh? Padre? I'm gonna go give it to him. Okay, you want me to bring it over to him? Okay, here, throw it right here. I'm gonna go. Let me help. Okay? Thank you. Yeah, keep up the good work. Merry Christmas. Thank you. Merry Christmas, buddy. Thank you. Have fun, okay? <laughs> All right. You need one of these, yeah. okay? Everybody needs a rod, okay? Let's see, let's get you a reel to go with that bad boy. There's a reel for you. Here's some baits, okay? So this would be more for trout. Bass, bass, yeah. trout, okay. cool? Uh, you need line too, let me get you a line. Merry Christmas. All right, you. you got it. Merry Christmas. Enjoy, buddy. Have fun. You need some new line, my friend. Yeah. This is brand new line, too. Is it? I had a, uh, a two pound bass on uh, fuzz bait. Yeah. One of those rocks on that far side. Okay. I had nighttime bass. Okay. Um, you ever try any big baits, like swim baits out here? I haven't. I've seen a lot on, like, online. Yeah. Them working. Yeah. Um, never tried. Never do you have any, do you have any gear to throw it? No, I don't have, like, a heavy line or anything like that. Do me a favor. Will you guys not leave for three minutes? Okay, I got something for you, right okay? And I got new line for you, too. You need some new line, too. Uh, yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> I was casting, and I'm like, I think I'm to the end of it. Yeah, that's, that's rough. All right, let's, let's fix some problems for you guys. Is this a date night or what? Yeah. Well, yeah, it is. Date fishing night? I love it. Okay, so, so there's a Mega Bass Destroyer P5 Flissa. It's like a $500 rod. Oh, my God. Okay. Here's a brand new reel for you too. It's a Daiwa Kage LT and some fresh six pound sunlight. Oh my God. Okay, so you're totally styling now. I'm styling. Okay. <laughs> you, dude, the buzzbait's a great idea. I fish here like three, four nights a week. The really? only thing I can ever get bit on is big stuff. Okay. I don't get bit very often. I'm not gonna kid you. It took me two years to catch one. Okay. Okay. Damn. Here's a brand new Mega Bass Mark 56. Sickest swim bait rod on the market. Thank you. Tatula 300 swim bay reel. This is line for that one. Okay. Okay. In here, there's line. There's some swim baits in here to get you started. Yeah, I've always seen swim baits that come from the East Coast. Just never really got into them. Cool. Where are you from? Maryland. Okay. So it's kind of a big thing here. Yeah. But again, this is like the hardest place in the world to fish. Yeah. So don't get discouraged. They live really tight. So all the edges underneath all these docks, all this stuff. But you just, once you get good at casting, there's a few different styles in here. Play with them, try them, Perfect. explore. Thank you. Okay, all yours. I'm Connor, what's your name? Ben. Ben? Merry Christmas. Wow. Pleasure. What's your name? So Jen. Jen, Ben. Merry yeah. Christmas yeah. to you guys, okay? Thank you. Yeah, Thank you, so much. you got it. I appreciate it. Are you gonna be out here? No, we're just wandering around. We're almost done. Really? Just giving stuff away. I so really appreciate you'll it. see, I don't know if you guys live around here or not, but I'm usually wandering around here a couple nights a week. So if you see me say, we just what's up? We just coming out here a little like, couple nights ago. Uh, All right. Ago. Yeah. But yeah, definitely stop by again. Cool. Well, I'll so look much. forward to seeing you checking the big baits. Yeah. Yeah. Merry Christmas. All right. Merry oh Christmas, guys. Yeah, of course. Oh my gosh, thank Merry you Christmas. so much. You got wow. it. Good luck tonight, okay? Yeah. All right. Merry Christmas to you guys. How's it going, guys? You guys catch anything? I am. Oh, cool. Well, you're on one right now if it's cool that we use this. Uh, it's at the end of our day. I'm just giving away some rods and reels for Christmas. You guys want some? Yeah. Okay. How about you? You want a rod? Okay, there you go. Uh, since there's a whole family of you, I got four. How about that? I got two casting and two spinning. You guys good with that? So I've got a Daiwa Kage drop shot rod. I've got a St. Croix Mojo, a couple major crafts. So let me give these to you. I'll let you split it up and share it. I got, I got all kinds of stuff for you. Thank you so much. 
You're going to need reels for those. So oh I would put this Kage on that Kage. Okay, that'll be like the perfect fit. I've got a couple of St. Croix 7 <laughs> bait casters for the bait casters for you guys. I don't have line for all of them, but I've got some line in here. So you guys can fight over it. Yeah. Okay, I know it's kind of towards the end of the night too. And here's a couple of gift bags of some Mega Bass baits in here, some Lucky Craft stuff. More designed for trout since that's kind of the season, but you guys can divide and conquer deal. Oh, thank you. Okay. Thank you so much. There you go. Yeah. yeah. Keep bringing these kids fishing. Oh, yeah, yeah. She caught her first truck today. Yeah, it was You her. did? Yeah, it was yeah. her. Good job. <laughs> All right. Well, enjoy the new gear. Thank you. Thank okay. You. And enjoy the Modellas. Thank you. you. Yeah. Trade. <laughs> if you've watched our video, you know that Jeff never drinks any oh, beers. Here. So, yeah, here, this would, be, this would be my final thing of the night. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Cheers. Thank you. Hey, good job catching that fish. <laughs> All right. Cheers, guys. Thank you. Have a great evening, Kay. I don't know if that worked. Did that work? That's perfect. Yeah. All right. Sick. Thank you. Hey. Merry Christmas to you guys. Yeah. Again, thank thanks for your service, dude. Thank you, man. Yeah. Keep those kids fishing, man. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. All right. Cheers and thank you for the beer. Best thing I've had all day, honestly. All right. See you guys. On behalf of myself and the entire team here at the Hookup Tackle, Merry Christmas, guys. Happy Holidays. Happy New Year. I hope you get a wonderful week and time with your family and friends. I hope you get some amazing gifts. I hope you get to catch some giant fish this week uh, and the upcoming year. And I hope you get some really good time uh, hugging all your loved ones. So that is a wrap for us. If you guys have made it through this video and you're like, where is my tackle? Here's a little promotion for you guys. Enjoy. Hey, what's going on, Hookup community? This is the number one son, Jacob Kohler, coming to you from Kawasaki, Japan. Wanted to wish you all a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. It's been a pleasure fishing for the Hookup this year, also working as a translator and as the official music director. Hope you have a Merry Christmas. I hope you catch some big fish and... Fuck, I fucked that up. Uh, anyway, Happy New Year. See ya. Hey. Huh? What are you doing? Well, it's been a long year. Christmas is almost over. Well, Mi let's get back to work. Misfit sale starting. Oh, the misfit sale. Enjoy everyone. Merry Christmas! <laughs>